2024's Big Top Bread and Circus. Oh, the distractions and the psyops that we have to dodge. And Brandon or Dark Brandon said, just like we drew it up. Well, Iran or Persia has entered the chatmosphere to say, Antarctica is ours and we're about to put a flag in it. It's easy to see why Iran or Persia is choosing now to come so direct and aggressive as a challenge to Brandon because weak men create hard times. Not to mention the Biden administration unfreezing recently $6 billion in Iranian funds will certainly help Iran with their Antarctic plans. And who's going to stop Iran from their Antarctic plans? After all, Iran was not a signatory to the Antarctic Treaty according to international law. Over the last few years, I've been really interested in learning all I can about Antarctica, as well as the North Pole. And we read The Smoky God a couple of years ago, and some people believe that there might be land beyond the ice walls. I find that fascinating, and I wanna talk more about that because I'm gonna do a little deep dive uh, into the North Pole. But the Antarctic region continues to be something that a lot of us feel that it is prohibited. And why do we think that? Because it isn't. Terra Australis Incognita, lands unknown beyond those southern ice walls. Chasdia was a name that was given to these mysterious lands after Noah's grandson, Cush. What if Iran is appointed to kick off a new age of discovery and exploration? I'm excited about this and personally, I'm fully confident in the scientific abilities of the Iranians because after all, for me, it was a Iranian or Persian surgeon that saved my life in Los Angeles at Cedar sinai a few years ago. And a lot of us don't believe in the villains that the American government and media tell us are villains. Everything is up for reconsideration because I know that we meddled in the affairs of Iran and they had a monarch, a sovereign monarch, and we meddled in their affairs. If you look at the images of what it was like in Iran before American intervention, we have a lot to answer for.